Hello and welcome to your at-home dance practice. If you've never heard of freeform movement, then welcome. I'm so excited that you found me. This is Movement Medicine and I help you get moving. I give you movement inspiration prompts and actually come into your home every week-ish with you in order to help you move. I film a video so that you can have someone to dance along with and not feel like you're alone, but yet have the privacy and the beauty of being in your own space because I know since I host an ecstatic dance space in Nashville and I've been part of what's called the conscious dance world for about six or seven years now I know that people get intimidated when they are invited into this dance space they think I don't know how to move like that I can't get my hips to move like that I don't know how to find a beat I'm gonna look foolish I'm afraid of what people are gonna say I'm worried about my safety what am I gonna feel like what am I gonna wear what is you know there's just all this intellectual stuff that goes on when you invite somebody into a dance space they think that they have to have it all together it's the exact opposite of what conscious dance is and what freeform movement is so let's just set the record straight that if you have a heartbeat and you know how to walk then you know how to move one of the things I always share about the dance space I host is that if you look at the conscious dance floor you will see not what you think dance is is that most people don't know how to dance that's because we have this image again of somebody that looks like a Latino being able to move their hips in a certain way and sway in a certain way or they can belly dance or hip hop. That's not what freeform movement is and that's the beauty of it is freeform movement is whatever movement you are inspired to do. You listen to the music, you follow your internal guidance, the internal movement energy of, of what's coming into you, and you express it out of you through your body language. That's all freeform movement is, and that's dance. That is absolutely dance. So now, why an at-home practice? A lot of people, again, as I've said, have been intimidated to come into a group setting. I've been so inspired by Yoga with Adrienne to have an at-home yoga practice that felt real and authentic and you could just tell how much she cares about people and I felt like that was a fit for me with dance. So I want to come into your living room, your bathroom, your kitchen, your bedroom, wherever you're gonna dance. You don't need a lot of space. You will see that I roll back my carpet when I'm at home and I do it in my living room, which is in a huge space to get down and dirty and wild and crazy. So you don't need a lot of space and I just wanted to be able to provide my warmth and my energy and my ability to give you permission to do this at home with yourself. A lot of times I'll, I'll probably just put the song over the actual audio to the music just because it's better sound quality for you to dance, but just know that I'm hooting and hollering in the background because I'm a noisy dancer. I always encourage people to make noise on the dance floor, to sing along at the top of their lungs, who cares what you sound like because sound is another amazing movement medicine and when you combine it with your actual movement woo, you're doing so many amazing things a couple other things to note is that you don't need anything special to wear just be comfy and ready to move and ready to sweat even though it's only three to five minutes probably most of these songs that we will do together I do put on little foot undies and I'll have the link down below on um, Amazon that way I just have some better grip shape and can do better turns. That's just my thing. Otherwise, most people dance barefoot when they're doing freeform dance. There are no instructions. There's no steps to follow. You do not need to look like me. You can repeat and copycat as much as you want if that helps you get into your body and into feeling safe and comfortable doing this freeform movement. And I use a lot of somatic tools that actually help to release trauma and extra stress in the body. So when you see me doing this kind of stuff or shaking a lot, those are actual somatic tools that I teach my clients to use and I use them myself. <laughs> Always a good example, right? All right, what else can I share with you? Uh, most of all, have fun. 
Join me back here on a weekly-ish basis as I release new dance videos that you can do at home with new music to encourage you to keep moving, to find your inspiration. I will include our movement inspiration prompts so that if you want to take the movement deeper into a journal time afterwards, I suggest doing it afterwards after you get everything flowing. Of course, I'll probably be sharing just little tidbits before each video to, to tune into as well with those movement inspiration prompts. All right, y'all, so much love. Please join me here as often as you can to dance with me so I don't feel alone, so you don't feel alone, and so that we have more movement, authentic body language, the language of the universe, and emanating out into all spaces of this earth. Please like and share this movement medicine with anybody that you know that can use this, and I look forward to dancing with you soon. So much love. Bye-bye. Oh,